This is going to be something, I'll tell you that much. The shrines call this place the Temple of Unification. The Zelnaga are somewhere within. So far, all I've encountered are hybrid. I've been fighting them for days. Progress has been difficult. Fighting them for the days? Of two days! Working together to seek out the halls of revelation within the temple. Only with both present will the shrines reveal the means to I believe the those those two Maga. races working together, Terran and Protoss. And yet, despite our history, here we stand together. Perhaps you should start. All right. So, if I highlight oh, I've got to select tier 1 ability. Let us make for the shrine. Uh Kinetic Blast. Tier 2 ability is the Chain Reaction. Yeah, Chain Reaction. Tier 3, Spawn Banelings. <laughs> spawn... Uh, spawn Splitterling. And the mutation is that they... Double damage, and then uh, fury. Upgrade complete. Okay. Command. Our Change is up. We shall prevail. It seems the temple has guardians. I will deal with them. Okay, so I should actually figure out. I know what uh, Phoenix and Kerrigan's abilities. What is yours? Dash, and slash, and heal. Okay. Okay. There we go. This is gonna be. This is gonna be something I can tell you already. So Artanis is E for heal, Q for dash. And W for big damage. You have my attention. My search continues. We shall prevail. Yes. And here I we go. Answer. Look out! Hybrid. U W U Q U E U W E N spin U Q U E U Q U W and Q and E E E E E U U U your queen, listen. Alright. So we're just gonna cycle them through, pull them around, pull them away. I serve. What is speak and you This is such a useless healing ability though. Oh the battery yes. heals kinda fast. I, another construct. We'll have to destroy it to open the doorway. Uh, where is Phoenix? There he is. You have no attention. My search continues. What if strength? A key is still missing. There is a powerful energy across this chasm. Carrion, remain. Carrion, the construct is coming for you. Uh, keep them all healed up. Make it quick. Okay, that worked. Answers. Phoenix is gonna be the one who dies. I can. I'm telling you now. Explain yourself. Yes. Fate is with us. The shrine still functions. No. Oh, and what does this shrine say? There, it gathers power. It should be active shortly. Oh, that's good. Hey, where are my bane links? Of yours. Not quite. It appears Amon's forces have found a way We left the front door open, didn't we? we? Must slay them all. I think I'm starting to like you, Artanis. Oh, it did despawn my bane links. That's so uh Uh, 
Uh, Phoenix. Oh, okay. We need to focus you down. Uh, you need to be doing that, and that, and that. You do that, and that. Run over here, and do that. And back this way. You, please. Uh, Ah, Mr. Artanis. Okay. We're doing okay here. Alright, we're working out okay. I, I see now. I don't understand how the shrine needs to power up to show pictures, but born. Within the void, their sacred purpose was to cultivate life and perpetuate the infinite cycle. At a new universe's creation, they take a physical form. If destroyed, they are thrust back into the void. Okay. All of this time, they have waited for us to assemble the keystone. And find our way here. So they've just been chilling? Like a villain? Amon indwells my people, possessing them through the Kala. But he has no physical form. If he were separated from the Templar, he could be forced back into the void. If he had a physical form, how the hell was he going to take control of the Kala anyway? Oh, I can't, uh, that's so unfortunate. There we go. What would you ask if change is a part? What is it already? Uh, I need answers. Okay, we need to make sure we grab the next solar cores. Okay. Okay. Uh, making sure I'm not forgetting solarite cores anywhere or anything. I, need answers. I think there's one per area. That seems reasonable. Make it quick. What fools you are to attack me! Your queen, speak. Oh, what is it? Oh, 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 okay. The fucking Thors, when they do their bullshit, they insta-lock you down. You can't move while you're taking the damage, which is total fucking bullshit. Explain yourself. We shall I am the swarm. What is it already? Able to stack a fuck ton of them together. Alnar shall serve as your tomb. Explain yourself. And there's Research another Zelnaga device. Our heritage is your future. Our future is your heritage. I need an They're fighting another construct. What is it? Oh. Make it. Alright, we're doing okay. Still not bad, not bad. It, now that I'm getting the hang of flipping between them, I mean, Carrick took a little bit of a beating there, but... You have my as long as we can keep the healing going. Ready your blade, Templar. You have my... This is... Oh, please heal. Make it quick. Uh, no, 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 no! Why did he turn around and run back in? All right, one sec.
Oh, okay. A little bit tight there. That was... That was close. That's a tricky fight. Those guys do a lot of fucking damage. Alright. Made it through number two. The shrines look like they're covered with pictograms. How do you know what they say? I don't. Communing with the shrine is I'm just making this shit up as I go. Each atom of the stone has been placed with meaning. Purpose. And what was the purpose of uh, that chip there? Oh, I just wanted to serve means attacked it. Well, really? So it wasn't placed with purpose? From Almar. That the Zell Naga began to seed the universe with life. They created us, just as they gave life to a numberless assembly of races in other universes. Every did any of them build uh, siege they tanks? Because if they did, well, the potential of their offspring, never interfering. The infinite cycle will always be the same. Two races are destined to emerge. One. Pure of essence, an indomitable spirit capable of great change, and one pure of form, a being capable of vast psionic potential, able to house the essence of a Zelnaga. So really, this is just the Zelnaga reproducing. They're not shepherds or anything. They're just like, okay, we need to make a galaxy so that we can fuck. Purity of essence and form, the Zerg and the Protoss. If the Zelnaga do not interfere, then it was Aemon who uplifted my people. All we thought was the Zelnaga was a lie. Come on, Artanis. We're not far from having some answers. They're destroying the shrine. Let's get to that shrine. I am the sword. We need to actually be a little bit quick here, so. These people are maniacs. Yep. They are maniacs. Speak. Make it quick. I've come this far. I gotta move. Explode. Oh, get out of the big laser. Yes, I've come this far. Change. Make it quick. Boldly. <laughs> well, that makes life easy. Oh, these things fucking hurt. Run away, <laughs> Artanis! <laughs> Oh, okay. Run away! Make it quick. You have my attention. Anis, run away. Kerrigan, run away. Research continues. Your team explains. Thing, Artanis. Artanis and Kerrigan must survive. Didn't say Phoenix need to survive. Why the fuck did Phoenix dying matter last time? I've come this far. Huh, game? Hey, look at them. They're in the cutscene this time. I don't know why they're the little ones, though. Ahead of us, within the Chamber of Ascension, the Zelnaga have slumbered as civilizations grew, fell, and formed again. They will awaken when the two destined races arrive. Okay, while well, we're here. The elders among them will give their lives to bestow their essence. And pure of form and pure of essence will be reborn as Zelnaga. Yeah, this is just them shepherds. They're banging. The infinite cycle.
So, what do you say? Ready to meet your maker? Indeed. Come. The Chamber of Ascension lies ahead. And our salvation within. How disappointing. It's like, oh yeah, your maker is just some weird squid thing. Phoenix. Don't help or anything, Kerrigan. Two. My will is not so easily broken, Amon. No, but your physical body is. Shall fear you no longer. Matriarch, there is a massive output of void energy spiking from the temple below. Target the epicenter. Hello. Understand what the whole teleport in she dashed towards him and then teleports behind him and he just like slowly turns around. Kinetically blasts her away. I do not come as your enemy, Dark Templar. It's like, how quaint. Listen to me, Matriarch. Amon's trap is sprung. Your leader is in grave danger. You think us fools? Yes, but that is irrelevant. What is relevant is that Amon has opened the gateway to the void. Alarak is such an A-tier a badass. Do you think us fools? Yeah, you're fucking stupid. But I need your help. I can guide you to Artanas before this fate befalls him. If we are bold, we can stop the Dark God's assault. Am I to believe that the moment you're released, your blade will not be in my back? You waste time. See? Grade A badass. He's like, see, these, these fucking shackles can't hold me. Get out of here with this shit. I am Alarak, first descendant of the Taldarim. I am Alarak, first badass of the Taldarim. Retribution will be claimed for this, and if your hierarch survives, he will aid in it. I like that. Make your decision. You know he's got an ulterior motive, but it's like, well, you know what? You will take us to Artanis. Most wise. He's like lawful evil in the best way possible, because he's like, I uh, look, I'm going to make a bargain, and it's going to be an even bargain, and I'm going to uphold my end of the bargain. Ooh, wow. 83 without... Ha that was that was pretty good. But, like, I'm going to uphold my bargain. I'm not going to do anything more or less. And if you don't try and... If you if you assume or make uh, rash judgments or anything about what you think I'm doing or not doing, then that's on you. I'm going to do exactly what I said I'm going to do. Rohana. Rohana! You saw it. Both your beginning and your end. Okay. 
Okay. Release her, Amon. What are you gonna do? Kill her? No, I guess you'd slice off her temporal things. Choice of words. And I'm not interested. Make your decision. I have made my decision. My decision is I'm gonna kick ass and chew bubblegum. This path will be all out of ass. I have done as I promised, Dark Templar. Now go tell your hierarch. I am waiting for him. Matriarch. Our High Templar have volunteered to aid you. They 420 the, the weed, of the man. was not easily born. But we are ready to serve once again. Templar. These guys look for your like mini time. Gundams, how we chonky they are. Unity through purpose. Unity. I call through and Oh. To me, my swarm. Templar, join us quickly. Oh, no, there. Don't you dare, Kerrigan. Oh, okay. She left that to the last possible second. Your forces have arrived just in time. Amon has opened a portal to the void. It must be shut down before That's a thing he can do? Why doesn't he just leave it open and annihilate the universe that way? But it's up to this you. is the other it's chonky you. hero from the Hawks camp. We draw power from these void crystals. We will need to destroy them if we are to seal the gate. Then it shall be done. All right. The darkness is approaching my hive cluster, Artanis. I hope you're getting ready to disable those crystals. Oh yeah, we're getting ready. I'll Don't you worry. I'll continue sending as many Zerg as I can spare to help you. Fight well, Templar. How much do these things cost? 150 and 100. We can warp one in. I want to see what its antimatter missile things are. They seem over the top. There we go. Hierarch, I am detecting several energy sources hidden across the temple. They appear to be Zelnaga vessels, ancient power sources. If we can locate them, I should be able to use their energy to free up additional solarite from the Spear of a Doom's core. Why on earth are you just ignoring all my shit? Come on. Okay, that was close. Okay, now let's... Chrono boost out a bunch of these. Build me a forge here, please, in the back. All right, there we go. Now, uh, you three on that, and 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 you're building good, and you're building good, and you're building good. Okay, now, we want you to please build me uh, gate, 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 and then we're going mostly... Okay, now we're looking good there. We want you to swing over here, and we want you to put a couple pylons every which way so we can deal with that. And then we want you to uh, build me a cybernetics core uh, one and two. No, uh, actually, just one. Shit. Tried to time that, save myself. Didn't work. I'm sending my army your way, Artanis. They'll help clear a path to the crystals. All right. Uh, we should move out with that. This warrior awakens. We are Let's focused. move in with them. Except for you, you back. You guys. And you guys back. All right, now we want to find this and go boop boop and boost it and boop 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 and 
you can drop a chrono boost on that. You guys, looking good. Now we can start to bring in. We're about a third of the way through, which is okay, because we are working on... You require more this being gas. Yeah, I know we need more gas. There's gas right there. Hey, you. Go get me that gas. Okay, that's all wrapped up, which is perfect. So now we want one, and we're going to Chrono Boost those three, because we're going to put that there. Okay, that'll slow things down a little bit. Crystal destroyed. Sensors are showing three more remain, Hierarch. Unity. Yeah, we'll give it a second. There we go. Okay, we're gonna move in with Kerrigan here as much as possible. As ever. Unbelievable. Despite eons of inactivity, these devices are still at full power. Artanis. Hurry up and disable those void crystals. My hive cluster is taking a beating. Warriors, the crystal is secure. Destroy it as soon as possible. Yeah, we're working on it. Two crystals destroyed. I suspect Amon's forces will not let us take the next two so easily. Hybrid are moving to attack our nexus point. Ready our defenses. Artanis, I am withdrawing to my hive cluster. I need some time to reconstitute my forces. Okay, well, we'll get that in a second, then. This warrior awakens. Let's get in there. Oh! Anything in the air dies pretty fucking quickly. The crystal is free of defenders. Our warriors can destroy it whenever you are ready. Only one remains. And the portal is growing unstable. We must destroy the final crystal, and do so with haste. Hybrid inbound on our nexus point. Warriors, intercept them. Okay, we'll intercept these hybrid. Survive much longer. I know I'm working on it. Thing, then. That hurt really badly. Yep, there we go. I am transferring the final power source now. Whew, that was a little bit tight on the timing there, but that that storm just about fucked us up pretty badly. We managed to get out of that, though, From the last point, possible second. We stand united. We shall turn back the tide of Amon's darkness. So what happens if he just destroys the door? Does the void thing open back up? We fought well this day, Kerrigan. Join us. Together, we can defeat Amon and send him back into the void. My swarm was broken here, Artanis. I'll need time to rebuild my forces. I have to go and fuck up a whole bunch of Terran. Time. My people are being Planets. consumed. Ticked. Their Essence. very flesh turned into Amon's own. I cannot wait. Then you must do as I have. Gather allies, subjugate enemies, do whatever you can to ensure victory. Survival is never pretty. We are very different leaders. But I thank you nonetheless. Until we meet again. The void portal within Ulnar has been sealed. 
but a greater threat looms. He can open it back up just by opening the door. Our people into a host form. While we were focused upon Ulnar, he has unleashed the full might of the Golden Armada. On. Using our own weaponry to eradicate life from planets across the Caprulu sector. Okay. Our current forces are not powerful enough to engage the Great Fleet. But Amon's other servants run rampant across the sector. Then we should strike immediately. Eliminate his outlying forces. I like that plan, the divide and conquer. The fires were designed for war. If we reactivate them, we can build our armies and destroy Amon's Zerbrudes in one fell swoop. That's fair. Assuming they do not turn on us first. The purifiers possess no loyalty, no honor. You waste time bickering. The Taldarim's death fleets are your threat. I alone can challenge Malash for the right to rule and bend his army to my will. Do not forget Moby's core. They are rumored to operate from a hidden base where they. If I had to do to order of operations, I would go Alarak. This is true, but we cannot engage the Purifier. Where they are. Outliers. Send your most elite Dark Templar to scour the sector. Cores. For now, Karax, your focus must remain with the Keystone. The survival He's of got a weird Beyblade thing on his on arm. I wonder if that's like a uh, super advanced Yu-Gi-Oh dual disc. Stop the coming oblivion. Hi, Rock. I believe I have found a way to save our people. Okay. Zeratul foresaw. This keystone can indeed be our salvation. How so? Explain yourself. Explain yourself, you lying sack of shit! The keystone was designed to be found and assembled by those who would ascend to become Zelnaga. After leading them to Ulnar, they would also expel its stored energy to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. The keystone siphons energies and redistributes essence, matter, information, Consciousness to this device, money, they are cryptocurrencies. I see that now. This is how it cleansed Kerrigan. It extracted the essence that forged her into the Queen of Blades, and then it used that energy to release Amon from the void. If I can discover how to control the Keystone, so we could use I'm it gathering that the Keystone Amon was supposed to just release the Zelnaga into the from the void so that they could do the whole meet and greet and reincarnation thing but since Amon was the only one left it was like okay well you just unleashed your own doom by accident okay but we pulled it off pretty handily so we press on further and further till next time guys later